See, vocal range is something that uh, depends on each person. There are people uh, who have a one and a half octaves vocal range. Uh, there are people who can have three. There are people who can have more than three. So, uh, and that is the entire beauty of, uh, uh, or, or that's that's where individuality of a person comes in. So, vocal range to an extent, while you can you know practice to increase it a little bit on the top and a little bit uh, on the bass side. Uh, it's it's like a it's like a rubber band. The minute you start giving too much of an effort to uh, giving too much importance to draw it beyond what um, is physically capable, you're just harming your voice. So, let's say if you have a vocal range of let's say uh, the uh, daivatam in the bass to uh, gandharam or madhyamam on uh, the tarastai, I think that's a really good vocal range. So. To start with, don't look at like a three octave vocal range and all that. As your voice gets warmed up, as you put in enough practice, the three octave uh, vocal range is something that will automatically develop. Meaning that your focus of practice should be to ideally sing within your comfortable range and gradually extend it by a little on the top and in the bass. Uh, the focus of your practice should not be, you know, uh, trying to sing. In fact, octaves. there have been many times when. Uh during our practice, we have felt that, like for example, when we practice Karahara Priya, Those are the Rigama Padani, just six for us. You know, using these six swaras, your raga can happen for the next half an hour. And it gives you tremendous joy. So, uh, for, for Carnatic music students especially, don't worry about the range. Range, uh, as he explained, the physical aspects of it, you develop over a period of time. But your focus must be on bhavam. Once bhavam happens, you know, the proper devotional appeal happens. Everything else will automatically follow. And um, I've I've also heard this um, 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 anecdote that uh, K V N Mama K V Narayana Swami Mama, one of the doyens of Carnatic music, known for both his range and the bhavam that he brings into uh, Carnatic music. Uh, when he practices, normally he just focuses on Sarigama Padanisa, Sanitama Magarisa. In that range, he just practices, especially on a day when he has a concert. It's not like he tries to extend it too much on the top or the bass. Right. See, my, my whole point here is Ram Kumar. For music students, the question is, if it is for music students, you know, I think they should not even worry about yeah, the range, true. right? They should just they should just practice uh, whatever kritis they've been taught with total surrender and bhavam. Everything else will... Obviously, when you come to a performance stage, these kind of questions will get answered on its own. 